circles finding the area. So for this presentation, we're going to talk about how what we already know, the area of a square, compares to the area of a circle, which is kind of new for us this year. So how does it compare? We know the area of a square is the area equals side times side, which is A equals S times S, or A equals S squared. So if we inscribe a circle in the square, the area of the square can also be found using the circle's radius. So A equals side times side, which is A equals 2R times 2R, because notice how I've got the two radius make that one side. So I carry that down. So now I've got the 2R there where I would have had the, the S before. So the 2R squared, which works out to 4R squared. So you can also find the area by dividing the square into four smaller squares. So I take it, chop it up into four equal squares, and that one radius will make up four equally sized squares all at r squared. So r squared plus r squared plus r squared plus r squared equals 4r squared. So we know that the area of the circle is less than the total area of that square. So now if we inscribe a square inside the circle, this square can be cut, into, cut and pieced into two smaller squares whose area can be found with the radius. So these two squares have a total area of 2r squared. So the small one, the one small one has an r squared area, the other one has a small area of r squared. Put them together, that's 2r squared. So we know that the area of the circle is greater than the area of these two small squares. So the circle's area is something between the areas of the larger and the smaller squares. Now the smaller square was 2r squared, the bigger square was 4r squared. So the area of the circle is somewhere there in between. So using what we know about circles, think of a special number that lies between the 2 and 4 that we have used in circle relationships in the past. So something between 2 and 4, special number in math. We know 3 is between 2 and 4, but it's not really that special circle number. 3.14 is a special circle number because that 3.14 is pi. So that means 2r squared is less than pi r squared is less than 4r squared. So that's where we get the formula for the area of a circle. So the final formula of the area of circle is a equals pi r squared.